You might remember we grew ordinary garlic and elephant garlic this year. Good heavens, it is enormous. Ordinary, giant, elephant, ordinary. One was much bigger than the other, but which one tastes best? I thought I'd make garlic bread with the two sorts and see if anyone could taste the difference. There were equal quantities of garlic, salt and butter added to identical baguettes. I told people to come at 6.13. 13? <laughs> yeah. yeah. All done. Now we just need some hungry taste testers. Luckily, I found some in our garden. We really must keep the gate closed more often. Let the testing begin. Hey, now, come now, 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 go. Hang on, I go on over to the other side of the table. No, nope, still can't see you. Hang on. Timothy, this is the first opportunity I've had. Congratulations on a wonderful okay. expedition on Tuesday. No, no, no. Tim just wants to say something now about the thing, and then now you want to have some food. Now, there's two sorts of garlic bread here. One's made with Elephant garlic and one's made with ordinary garlic. Everyone was encouraged to taste and compare the two sorts. To be honest, they didn't need much encouragement. I think just the same. I like B more than A. It was hardly any difference, and I would eat both them any day. Well, they were both very nice, but B was definitely more garlicky. <laughs> I agree. Mm, I think it's conclusive, isn't it? B, so far, is the most popular. Mm. B, B was garlicky. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Garlicky, yeah. <laughs> More garlicky? <laughs>